Hello and welcome. Get ready. It's time for Sunday afternoon football. Perfect weather here in Geelong. Gary Lyon is with me today. Welcome, Gaz. Hi, Hutto. Really excited about this one today. Hitting the turf today will be Geelong and the visiting team. The captains of both sides make their way to the middle for the coin toss. Geelong kicking to the left of screen. Four rounds in and there's still question marks over a couple of sides in the competition. Let's see what these two teams can bring today. It's been an intriguing start to the year with a few surprises so far. I wonder if we'll see another one today. Both these teams coming off good wins last week. These lineups look very strong and both teams look fired up and set to go. What an exciting matchup we have here today. And here we go, it's Geelong. Taking on the visiting team, Electric hacks it out of there. Doesn't hold onto the mark. Majacek with a shorthand pass. Van Kervis hammers it at goal. <laughs> the visiting team lead is now one. Found space for an easy mark. He drives it. Dishes it off. Has it now. Majacek gives it off. And now they go. Drifts the Now they lead by two. Stewart. Players move as they look to provide an option. Moves it by foot. Takes the mark all by himself. Kicks it out of the defensive 50. Dug out by Revolt. Picked up by Smith. Henry keeps coming. Daz was surrounded. He needed to mark it, and he did. Penetrating handball. At full stride, receives the handball. Brown gets in a good position. 35 metres out. He did really well there, and get... Back in the middle. One down by Nan Curvis. And we'll get a ball up. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? There's some great skills on display right now. A great match. Gets the handball away. He can take off after that handball. The loose ball picked up. Guides it down. Wins the race to the ball. Revox steers it towards goals. The visit looking to bring it back into play. Plays on from the kick in. Stewart clearing kick out of the defensive 50. Just sends it into space. Missed the target. He drives it towards goal. Not happy with that kick as it goes out on the full. Two, he collects the kick. It's a foot race to get this one. He gets his hands on the footy. The visit looking for options now. The mark has been taken. A low stabbing kick. Gets into a good position to take that. He spears the ball. Walker scoops it up. Ball gets cut off. Putting his skills on display. Puts on the afterburners. Spills the mark. Picks up the loose ball. Searching for a teammate.
Dishes it off. He's got the footy in his hands. Slams it on the boot. Did it carry? I think it's a goal. Celebrating hard. The visiting team could kick the last two goals. The margin is 17. Back in the middle. Has the rucks go at it? Tap down. With the ball now. Moved on by Electric. Ends up turning this ball over. Henrik sends one up towards the wing. Stanley goes with the kick. Got hands to it. Higgins picks it up. Walker releases the ball. Fends off the tackler. Decides to kick. A clean pick up. A loose ball scooped up. O'Connor kicks hurriedly. Steady hands there as he holds that one. Smith earns a free kick. Geelong would love to make the most of this opportunity. The distance might be just beyond him. He heads for home. Started the kick wide and it never came back. Geelong, how? Playing up the options now. An easy grab for 14. Punches the kick. Greenwood found some space and marked. Handball's out into space. Doing well was Markle. Wins possession. Blitzarves heads up. Now it's a baller. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? It's a really good contest out there right now, and it's great to watch. 29, short by hand. A spearing kick from 16. Ball off hands. Did well not to confuse himself. Wants to keep it moving. Just put it on the booth. Guthrie marks in a bit of space. Goes with the kick. Big chance to score from this inside 50 stoppage. Ball tossed back in. Won it down. Fighting hard was Hawkins. Gets a touch to the ball. Well collected. Going for goal number one. His teammates rush over. Geelong close the gap to 10. Some great ball movement there. and just knew they were going to score. The umpire set the bounce to restart the game. Frost just slaps it down. Controlled well off the bounce. Kicks hurriedly. Dug it out. Just not good enough with that kick. 11 points the difference. Players move as they look to provide an option. Henderson uses it by foot. Higgins marks it. With a driving kick. Nice mark under pressure. Looks up with the kick. Blitzarves leading the race to the loose ball. Ball up in the centre square. Frost with the punch. Thank you, I'll have it. And now we'll have a ball up. Frost went it down. Collects the loose ball. It'll be a ball up. The visiting team are in front in the clearances and it's allowing them to create pressure up the field and scoring opportunities. Scoops up the ball. Narrowly avoids the tackle. O'Connor spills it. 29. Landed in his back on this occasion. Uses it by foot. A quick handball from Majacek. Back now from Greenwood. Gets it away under pressure. Practicing some fancy moves. The end of the final term sees the score as standard. The visiting team, 18. To Geelong, 7. The visiting team should be happy with their lead, Hutto. They came out focused and committed to a very good game plan. Let's have a closer look at the stats. Geelong needs to make the most of their chances inside 50. They aren't getting too many of them at the moment, so they need to capitalise when given the chance. Thanks, Gary. The siren sounds for the start of the second quarter. Back with another centre bounce. Nan Curvis won the hit out. Just handballs into space. 
He gains possession. Up for grabs for Dangerfield. Myers dropped what he should have taken. Stanley, can he put it through? It's somehow pitched over the line, and it's a goal! This is how they can score big, Hutto. Huh? We resume hostilities. Thump clear. Let him up, well, well. Ball up in the centre square. What can you tell us, Gaz? I'm really enjoying this one, Hutto. He gives it a ride. Stewart doesn't make the tackle. He loved that one. Now they lead by 11. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. It's great to watch, Hutto. Plenty of excitement. The game is back underway. Stanley thumps it forward. Dangerfield kicks it. Marks all alone. Moves the ball by foot, and the mark will be paid. Kick by Cameron. Smith going for number one. Makes the most of that kick. It's a goal. He celebrates hard after that. They are within a kick. That's a really good team, though. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. The visiting team have taken control of the outside game. They've been able to find more space in the opposition, and it's paying off. He lays off the pass. 16. Goes to the man on the run. Couldn't take it. Cleanly picked up. Just got the hands in the back there. 35 metres out. Golden opportunity here. Going for goal number one. Send it up. And he delivers perfectly. 29. Great bit of play that resulted in that. We're back in the middle now. Nankervis got a fist to it. Just gets it onto the boot. Couldn't complete the mark. Smith works one on the boot for goal. He's missed it. Deciding where to go with the kick in. The mark is taken by six. The visiting team are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Greenwood flicks it over. Hacking it out of there. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of footy. O'Connor, hurried kick. Couldn't quite with the mark. Finding the ball was 29. Tui wins it back. Links with hands. Drives the kick hard. Picked off by Smith. Quick handball. 14 on the move now. Sinks the slipper into it. Elects to kick. Stanley just gets it onto the boot. Keeps it alive under some pressure. And the ball ends up over the line. Toss back into play. The visiting team have been extremely well organised at the stoppages and it sees them being able to win the ball from the clearance. Thrashes it. He's got the football now. We'll get a stoppage. It's been a clearance game and right now the visiting team are on top in that area. Collected by Walker. Slick with the hands. Has a runner alongside him. Turned it over. Thank you. My ball, says the umpire. Thumps it clear. 16, slick with the hands. Hurried kick. He gets another possession. Gives it to 23. 
Phillips now. Wasting a lot of effort there. Jenkins clears the congestion. Stanley with the opportunity in front of goal. 50 metres from home. Should be relatively straightforward from here. He might kick a goal. Goes wide from behind. Howe ready to bring it back into play. Walker doesn't make the tackle. Takes possession. He has the ball. Just gave it away. Nan Kerbis getting in on the act. Is in his possession. Somehow got the handball away. They can create from this. A piercing kick from Higgins. Puts boot to ball. We will get a ball up. Can you tell us anything at the moment, guys? This is a classic game we're seeing right now. Sweeping handball. Myers going for number one. It looked impossible, but he made it work. Gets some reward for his efforts. Geelong close the gap to three. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. That cut. Umpire ready to resume play. Swatson. Finding the loose ball was Nan Curvis. Henry rushes with the kick. Intercepted. Hands that ball to the opposition. McLeod with an easy mark. Going for goal number two. Made the goal by a move. And it's a behind. Just a few points the difference. Stewart to kick it in. He gives chase to the footy. 16 can link up through hands. He takes aim. Oh, what a goal! McLeod puts his second on the board. Look at him. He really enjoyed that one. The margin is 10. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. The visiting team are getting more of the ball on the outside, and it's their outside run that is generating plenty of scoring opportunities. Picked off the deck. Frost has the ball. Rushes with the kick. Henderson looks to get onto the football. I'll have it. The umpire calls for the ball now. Hammers it. Electric going for number one. Slams it under the boot. Phillips looking to trap down the footy. Sweeping handball from Higgins. Kicks to the square. A mark by Hawkins. Handballs. Linking by hand. Myers hooks the kick. Just two goals in it. The visiting team have actually turned it over more than the opposition, but they haven't allowed that to translate into... Geelong looking to redeem themselves in the second half. They trail by nine. The visiting team have had a solid first half and will look to show more of the same in the second. Revolt couldn't snaffle it. Here's Gaz to break down the stats. Geelong can't get their hands to the ball in the contest. The modern game is all about winning the hard ball and they're not doing that today. Thanks for that, Gary. It's half time, and no doubt the coaches will want to have a chat to their teams about their first half performance. We're set to go at the start of the third quarter. We're back in motion. Nan Curvis with a big fist on it. 
12. Made the tricky bounce look easy. Arches his back. Smith misses the tackle. Racking up possessions now. Takes the mark. The visiting team just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. The umpire calls for it. It's a big stage of this game. The visiting team are winning the ball out of the clearance and are capitalising. It's much easier to score when you're always on the front foot. Nobody can hold on here. Might be a bit of an injury for 14. I think the doctor will be taking a close look at that one. 23. Moves it by hand. Releases by hand. Here's a chance for 29. Moves it quickly. Stanley determined to reach the ball. Goes for the goals. That looked great. What a goal. The time to celebrate. And don't they get around, Brown? That's two in a row for the visiting team. The visiting team by 15 points. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. Center bounce. Punches are clear. He wins possession. Intervening brilliantly was Henderson. Now we've got a ball up. Frost just swats it away. O'Connor grabbed it clean. Takes it well. Hawkins has resources out wide. Advances now. Spears the ball. Open opportunity for Myers. So what can Geelong do with this opportunity in front of goal? Moving on. He goes it alone. Myers has missed the box. Kick goes astray and it's out on the full. Twenty-three, keeping it low. A big contested grab. Pierce plays it on. Got boot to ball. Gets past the tackle. Full spin. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gas? I'm loving what this game is giving us right now. Frost dug out the loose ball. Now with a low spearing kick. Mitek with the mark. Handballs to no one in particular. Wants to keep it moving. Gathers it now. O'Connor just gets the kick away. Clears the congestion. Weller. Handballs. Electric is streaming past and gets the footy. Blitzarves has resources out wide. And the ball bounces across the boundary line. Six coming out of the ground. Ball to be tossed back in. Ball back into play. Frost thrashes it. Here's Clark. I hope that's not serious. But boy, he looks to be in a lot of pain. Gaz, can you tell us what you saw? Yeah, definitely something wrong here. He's trying to get off the ground as quick as he can. Six. The visiting team have been poor with their ball use. They've turned it over on too many occasions, and it's allowing the opposition chances to score. Looks to move it by foot. He has to hold on to those. 16. Handballs to no one in particular. The umpire will ball it up. Big thump from Frost. Made the tricky bounce look easy. Ball collected. The kick releases the pressure. Releases the handball. Marks in a bit of space. He wins the ball in the air. Hawkins moves it now. Finds himself in space and marks. Higgins puts it on the boot. Phillips runs after the ball. Mops up the loose ball. Movement by hand. He gets his hands on the footy. He's on fire at the moment, Gaz. He seems to always be in the contest, Hello. Nan Curvis having an impact right now. The opposition need to get a hold of him. Brown love kicking that one. The visiting team, 50, like Geelong, 28. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. 
Back in the middle to resume play. Punched away. Finds a way around the tackler. A lot of possessions for him. Ball up calls. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? I'd love for the coach to send a message out there and tell these players to take the game on. I haven't seen it for a while, Gaz. Well, he hasn't had the impact we were expecting. Just hits the post and a minor score. How unsure of the next move. Decides to play on. How kicks hard along the boundary line. Pierce drives the kick. Higgins drops the mark, uses a short handle. Offline or behind. Ready to bring it back into play. Can't take possession. Radagalia with a chance if he can keep his cool. Big kick required from this distance. Going for goal number one. Well taken at ground level. It's a turnover. Decides to keep it alive. Dalhead's found time to get it on the boost. Smith looking to put through another goal. Congratulated by his teammates. Geelong reduced the margin. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. It's been a clearance game and rock. About to resume hostilities. Clears the contest. Gets a quick kick away. Goes by foot. The ball mopped up. He's got the football now. He gains possession. Hands it out to open space. Just gave it away. Has it now. Guthrie gains possession. He just cut. What did you think of the third term, Gaz? The visiting team believe they can win this game. It's time to show it. What stands out for you, Gaz? The visiting team have been terrific at finding space to move the ball. Their ability to find a player in space is first class and it sees them in charge. Cheers, Gaz. Last quarter action, ready to go. They have to go quickly to have any chance from here. Hammers it. Phillips gathers it now. Sends it clear of the contest. Good mark there. <laughs> 35 metres out. Can he put it through? It's going to be close. Rebo getting the crowd involved. The visiting team played Geelong. 56. It's great to watch Hutto. Plenty of excitement. The visiting team could winning the ball out of the clearance and are capitalising. It's much easier to score when you're always on the front foot. Thumps it clear. He's got the footy in his hands. Higgins keeps it moving. Dahlhaus slams it onto the boot. Quickly onto the boot. Uses it now. Myers marks uncontested. 40 metres out. A chance to put a second goal on the board. It was always pushing that post and pushing. Teammates break for him. They can just slow the game down now, take a bit of time off the play. The kick from six. Finds this one all by himself. Pierce kicks it. Ball hits the deck. Brown cuts it off. Thank you, I'll have it. We'll have another ball up. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? It's a really entertaining game of football. Frost quickly onto the boot. 
There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Thrashes it. 12 comes away with the ball. Collected the ball well. Finding the ball with ease. Going for goal number one. Greenwood couldn't be happier with that goal. The visiting team could kick back-to-back -back goals. The lead is now 25. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. About to resume play. Frost hurls it away. Dangerfield kicks out of the congestion. Picks it up. Goes short by hand. Keeps the kick low. Marks that ball uncontested. Brown wants to keep it moving by hand. He takes the shot. Unbelievable effort. And it ends with a goal. This kick has extended their lead. McLeod celebrates with the fans. He did really well there and gets the reward. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. We're back in the middle to resume play. Frost slaps it away. Avoids the pressure. Thank you, I'll have it. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? This is not enough effort out there at the minute. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. One down. Finds the loose ball. Brown must have double vision. Just gets it onto the boot. Gets the loose ball. Gets a quick kick away. He's really making an impact in this game, Gaz. He's everywhere at the moment. I hope that's not serious. He looks to be in a lot of pain. Gary, what do you think it is? He's coming from the ground now, Hutto, but it didn't look great. That tackle just too high. Smooth collects it. Dug out the loose ball. Cameron clears the ball from the contest. 16 will be upset with that. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Maybe the coach needs to get on the phone to him and give him some instructions. Finds his man. Goes by hand to Greenwood. He slams it towards goal. The drop pipe goes straight between the big sticks. That pushes the lead further out. Look at them celebrate that effort. The visiting team is starting to take control. That's a really good team goal. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. Umpire ready to resume play. Frost guides it down. The tackle misses completely. The umpire calls for a stoppage. The visiting team are taking advantage of their Ruckman's ability. It gives them first use at the stoppages and forcing the opposition to defend. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Tap came from Frost. Showing control was Cameron. Gets it away. He has the ball. Henderson gets on the end of that handball. Myers missed an opportunity to mark. Manufactures the handball. 14, just put it on the boot. Snaffled up by Blitzarbs. Harford links up with a chance to run. Finds a bit of room to mark. Henderson looks to convert this opportunity. Needs a big kick if he's going to put this through. Well picked up. Does well to keep it in play. Couldn't go on with it. Ball goes out. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? This game needs a spark at the moment. With the ball is how goes by hand. Ball gets cut off with quick hands. Takes possession. Lobs the handball. Receives the handball and takes off. Turns on the gas. The visiting team are happy about that one. 
enjoying that goal. That's five in a row for the visiting team. Margin starting to really blow out. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. Back in the middle, has the rucks go at it. Cameron won the hit out. Daz, the umpire, will ball it up. Frost won the duel. McLeod making it ball up in the centre square. Ned Curvis got the tap. Electric gets on the end of this. Thank you. We'll get a ball up. Taps it down. Meyer check on the ball. Off hands. Collects the loose ball. Handballs to a teammate on the run. Weller puts it out on the full. Puts it on the boot. Mark me in space with slits arms. Had plenty of the ball. I put it. The umpire calls for it. Wins the ruck duel. Outruns the tackler. Finds a target. Chose to kick it. Seen plenty of it. It's a turnover. Parfit has a teammate on the move. Dangerfield grabs that one. Decides to kick. He takes the mark. The visiting team haven't been able to set up any set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect the forward to kick. The game never reached any great heights, and it ended as a bit of a one-sided affair. They have to learn from this experience. People will start asking questions of Geelong if they continue to play like they did today. Final scores are 80 to 37. That's it for us. We'll see you again next time. Thanks, Hello. Until next time, that is. Where the heads held high, our backs against the wall. When the clock runs out, once I takes it all.